Hello ladies and gents, Ro here, and welcome to Normal Films. And this is my 50th, 50th iMovie tutorial, you guys. So let's jump right in. We're gonna cover theater mode, or no, 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 not theater mode. We're gonna cover trailers, how to make trailers. And uh, well, you can put them in theater mode, but let me launch iMovie here. It should be already open. And uh, we're in our iMovie event. What we're gonna do is uh, straight off the bat, we're gonna go up to this little plus sign at the very top. We're gonna create, and we're gonna go instead of movie like we've normally been doing. We're gonna go to trailer, and it says follow a template to create a Hollywood style movie trailer. Now. Um, please note that it says follow a template, which is really what it really has you do. There's no actual freedom in it. Like if you wanted to do, do like an actual trailer that you wanted to make like professional, you want to do everything yourself in there. Uh, I suggest going into Final Cut Pro. Now, if you're looking into just, you want to follow a template for a good trailer that, I mean, it'll still look pretty good. Honestly, these templates are quite amazing. I would say as long as you choose the right one, you're still going to make a good trailer and with the nine movie, but here is uh, several of them. You can choose some from several different templates hit the little play button to actually look over them i do suggest that but the title of them actually shows you a quick a little uh, description of the trailer how it's going to look adventure coming of age documentary epic drama family film noir friendship holiday indie love story pets narrative retro romance scary it's these are some really good honestly there's so so many good templates here for example let me show you an example of this holiday one and like I, uh, this is uh, all with provided by iMovie. I do not own none of this that iMovie. This is actually just examples made by iMovie. Now, you guys, I gotta admit, you get, that is a really good, honestly, template. Now, what you're gonna do if you wanna use the template, just simply double click on it and it'll launch it. Then you can, from here, you can choose a name for it and then put it in the event that you would like it in. So I'm gonna just call it the holiday and I'm gonna put it in an iMovie tutorial event. So I'm gonna let, it's gonna take a little bit to create. It shouldn't take actually longer than 10 seconds. But once it's done loading, I'm gonna be able to load it up for you guys and show you what you can change and how it basically works, the basics of it. That way you can you guys get on your way and get started to use you and uh, make your own trailer for your own channel. But so let's just begin. Uh, for here is first your outline. This is gonna be where you have the movie, the the movie name and uh, release date. It's really very explanatory right here. The release year, start. And the stars, basically the star studio name, logo style, and some more of the credits regarding. Um, but you can add more as well. Now let's go to storyboard. This is your actual. This is where you're gonna create your actual project. But before I go to storyboard, let me show you shot list is the actual shots that are taken that you can use from your actual project and add them in. Now let me go to storyboard and show you the basic basic. So you have these little titles. These are where you actually see the. Like you can see here, no one with films. It's got this really nice, uh, basically logo look to it. Um, and then the uh, normal films, you can edit this. As you drag through, you can see how it's animated to you, or how how it goes through. So you can add this and change it to whatever you would like, normal films. But I'm gonna leave it 
just right there. And I'm not gonna go through the entire thing, I'm just gonna show you guys how you can do it and then you guys can finish your own trailer as you go on. But you gotta just edit the text as you please. And then also your actual, this is where you're gonna enter your first clip. This is landscape. It gives you a little example of how, what you should make the first clip look like. For example, this is, it wants an action here, a wide and an action again and medium. And then you also have the wordings that you can actually change and adjust like I showed you just a little bit ago. So let's go to our first clip here, landscape. And then what you're gonna do once you have your clips at the bottom, you basically go over and select what you would like. Now, if you notice already, it already has, um, all you have to do now is once you have your footage, all you have to do is just simply just click once and it will put it in there, 2.4 second. Uh, version of that clip as you can see there's already a selected portion of my clip that I'm dragging over like I haven't even done any I haven't selected anything yet it just automatically creates a 2.4 second selection and wherever you click that's where that's where it'll, it'll select so for example I'm gonna click right here it's gonna add that 2.4 seconds in the first portion take you to the next clip automatically now this is an action and uh, so I'm gonna this is gonna be a really poor trailer I'm gonna tell you guys right now because this is just my brother and I in a spa and it's not really meant for trailer purposes. I'm just gonna show you guys the basics. You see 1.8 second, it has like a little still frame. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna choose actually one of these uh, YouTube pictures and then it wants another action. Let's go like, uh, we're doing an action right here it looks like. So let's, let's choose that clip there. Then 1.5 second medium, looks like it just like a still frame almost that you're zoomed in a little bit more. I'm gonna go just choose this YouTube logo and then we're gonna to go to this medium again. And on this one, we're gonna choose just a text box, another action. And you can see I'm just simply just selecting the clip, just hitting, I mean, I mean selecting, I'm just just uh, left clicking on the portion of the clip that I want and it puts it in. So let's just play what I have so far and I'll show you guys how this looks like. So you just hit the space bar to play from the beginning. As you can see, my trailer was nothing compared to what I showed you guys uh, the preview of before. But like I said, I don't have the correct footage here. I might show you guys in the future of a, a good trailer that I'm actually make for you guys. And uh, if you guys would like me to do that. But other than that, this is the basics. You just select where you want to, uh, what clip you want to add up. And then go to your footage and just hit simply left click on the por that portion and it will add it automatically for you. From there, you can edit all the following uh, clips to add additional dates. And this hall, the credits, just you can change just the basics. You can't do your own like animations in there. You, you just do what is what it allows you. There's which is really limited, but at the same time, it turns out pretty well if you do it correctly. Other than that, you guys, thank you for uh, watching this tutorial, and I hope I helped you guys out. And leave any questions in the comment section below. Be glad to get back to you guys as soon as possible. And uh, that's the tutorial 50 of iMovie. Thank you guys and later. Let my life be the proof, the proof of your